My name is Joff Howell, and I've been doing the Windows for Porto since 1988. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel! Port Halt, the Rolls Royce of bed linens, claims to have created the first printed sheets in 1920 and is famous for its flowery fancies. Years later, today, they are a prodigy in the industry. Let's have a look at the $2,350 set of sheets, D. Port Halt Luxury Linens. Before we start, I'd like you to hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our videos. Number 6. You may go bankrupt. You will never go back to those oh so comfy and cheap jersey sets once you snuggle into these sheets. However, these clean linens will cost you at least more than two grand, so you may end up bankrupt. With sheets and pillows of all sizes, real luxury demands a least of seven pillows on the bed, window treatment and other accoutrements, like matching water baskets, one can transform their bedroom into a floral artistic garden. D. Port Halt Boutiques, Harrods, Le Bon Marche, and Bergdorf Goodman, as well as famous Relais and Chateau locations throughout Europe, carry the line. Depending on the print, a king size set of bedding might cost anywhere from $3,650 to $6,500. Number 5. What distinguishes D. Port Halt from others? So what is it that makes them so distinctive? They're crafted from 100% Egyptian cotton that has been hand selected and woven to last for generations. However, fabric softeners can also harm them, so they should be tumble dried 90% of the time, ironed or steamed, and stored in a place where they can breathe. Number 4. One just can't get enough of Port Halt's beautiful floral sheets. It's been dubbed a cult. The French enterprise has been a glamorous staple since Madeline and Daniel Port Halt produced their first colorful printed bed linens in 1924. As the new book, D. Port Halt, The Art of Luxury Linens, Gibbs Smith, attests. At the White House, Jacqueline Kennedy slept on Port Halt sheets, and actress Catherine Deneuve favors Bouquet de Violet's table linens. Following in the footsteps of her mother Jo Carroll and grandmother Estée Erin Lauder, a home furnishings businesswoman, can't get enough of Port Halt's gorgeous floral sheets, table linens, towels, cocktail napkins, and even the shams for travel pillows. Brown and white for winter destinations and brighter ones for tropical spots, Lauder reveals, adding that if it weren't for her husband, their bedroom would be a flutter of lilac blooms stirred by an invisible wind. Number 3. It's a happy product. Joan Carl, who has run the firm with her husband Bernard since 2005, explains, Port Hall prints are never static. It's never just a bloom. The flowers have movement, as though you're walking through a meadow. Details add a touch of dressmaker. Madeleine Porthalt used the work of couturier Maggie Roof, which explains the scalloped edges and biased trims on the linens. Think bright, fresh, and printed, or embroidered on pure white for Port Halt's palette. It's a happy product, Carl says. Who couldn't use a little more happiness in their lives? Number 2. The Super Bed Sheet Business Peach Crepe de Chine with apricot embroidery for $2,620 for the top sheet alone may be the pinnacle in bed linens today or the $15,000 beribboned and frilled outfit from Deport Halt & Company's catalog. It was made in France of the finest material, embellished with vagoing, inlaid with satin ribbons, and finished with handkerchief eyelet at that price. One Washington tycoon's wife, who asked to remain anonymous, similarly purchased twin beds. The set cost nearly $20,000 after tailoring it to match her decor and adding a few throw cushions. Buying premium bed sheets may be the perfect self-indulgence if money isn't an issue. They will be appreciated primarily by you and the laundry unless the queen comes to visit. Number 1. The most expensive set of sheets globally. Jane Borthwick, Port Halt's president in the United States, went even farther in expressing customer loyalty. We've been involved in divorce cases where there was a question of custody of the linens. Women may change their husbands, but they don't change the sheets. Port Halt could be the greatest manufacturer of these premium bed linens in America, as well as in more than 40 other nations. The company's luxurious table linens, towels, curtains, decorator textiles, wallpaper, and even covers for corporate jet bunks and pet baskets are all made with the same precision. 
Borthwick mentions that Port Halt linens have been dubbed the most expensive in the world. One ray of hope? The company's printed percale is only a few hundred dollars per sheet, not thousands. A flowery design with a scalloped border in a contrasting color is the company's hallmark sheet and its bestseller. Madeleine Porthalt, the company's founder, designed the first floral sheets in 1925. According to Borthwick, her linens have been used to decorate many great beds, including those of Charlie Chaplin, the Duke and Duchess of Windsor, and Barbara Hutton. In the White House, John F. Kennedy slept on Porthalt bedding. In New York, Port Halt set a record for the greatest single sale to one person in one day, selling 20 sets of embroidered linen sheets and pillows for $145,000 cash, or $7,250 per set. Borthwick would only say that the buyer was a woman who worked in the entertainment industry internationally. That brings us to the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit like if you did. Well, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. Also, watch the two videos on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.